What's up you guys, it's Thomas here and today I'm going to be showing you how to get out of a respring loop on check range jailbreak on iOS 14. Essentially the reason this happens is because safe mode isn't yet compatible with iOS 14. So if something goes wrong with your jailbreak and your device crashes, you're not going to boot into safe mode, you're just going to be stuck in a respring loop. But before I actually go on to fixing your respring issue, if you're new to my channel, please do consider subscribing. Only about 1 in 200 of my viewers actually subscribe. So it really means a lot to me if you do decide to join that 0.5% of viewers that did subscribe. Anyway, let's get to the fix. So you're going to need to get your computer handy and plug your device into it. And now we're going to open up CheckRain on your computer. So just make sure you're opening up CheckRain 11, which you use to jailbreak your phone. And let me open it right here. And here you're going to click Options. And you're going to toggle on Safe Mode. And now you're going to hit done and you should just see welcome to check rain and it's going to say your device version and hit start. Now you're going to hit OK if you get this pop up, hit next. You're going to bring your device now into recovery mode, which check rain will do for you. And it should boot up like this. Now you are going to hit on your computer, the start button and follow the on screen instructions, which should help you get your device into DFU mode. So for me, I'm just holding down the home and power button. Now just the home button. And once my computer says DFU mode enters successfully, uh, it will start to jailbreak my device and boot it up into safe mode. As you can see, my device is booting up into jailbroken mode. Might take a few seconds. And now I can just enter my device passcode now that it's booted up. And as you can see right now, none of my tweaks are active, but I'm going to want to open up Cydia. Wait for it to load up. It might take a few seconds since I'm just starting my phone up. Here we have it. And you're going to go to your installed page and you're just going to install the tweak that's causing your issues. Uh, it might be just your most recent tweak you installed if it crashed right after installing. Otherwise, you got to figure out which tweak it was. For me, I know that it was the quit all tweak. So I'm going to find that one. Here it is. You're going to hit modify and you're going to remove the tweak and wait for it to remove. Restart your springboard. And now you're not actually going to boot up into a normal jailbroken mode. Your tweak still won't be active. So we got to wait for it to respring. Then we got to go back to our computer with check rain. And here we have it hit options, uncheck safe mode, go back and start the jailbreak process again. And here we're going to jailbreak into normal mode. Just as we did before, we're going to go into recovery mode right quick on our actual cell phone. And then we're going to have to hit next and go into DFU mode. So this might take a few seconds. Then once our device is actually in DFU mode, which we should be in DFU mode pretty soon. Uh, okay, here we are. Now it's going to start the jailbreak process once more, but with our tweaks enabled. So let's just wait for it to boot up. All right, so our device is now booted up, but as you can see, our tweaks aren't showing. This is another bug in CheckRain on iOS 14. So you get them to pop up, open up Cydia, wait for it to load up. Here we have it, go to installed, tap on your most recent tweak you installed, and you're just gonna wanna reinstall that tweak. So let's do that right quick and restart Springboard. Essentially, the only reason we're doing this is to restart the Springboard. Um, there's no issue with a particular tweak and once it's restarted it should have all your tweaks loaded up just like we have it here hope this helped you fix your issue and let me know if you have any issues uh, down in the comments below don't forget to hit the like button and i hope to see you in my next video bye